A big star heading back to Broadway. Fox 5's Ryan Christopher has the details. Well, what's up there, food god? You and to you, Rosanna Gaten Matarazzo is living his best life at 19 years young. The Stranger Things star just got an apartment here in New York City. He has a new movie coming out, and he's heading back to Broadway for the third time, now playing Dustin in Stranger Things. That's how you know him, the actor who grew up in South Jersey, taking on the role of Jared Kleinman in Dear Evan Hansen on Broadway. And I had the chance to chat with him one on one. You guys are at the, the top of the game right now with Stranger yeah. Things. Cliffhanger, everyone's waiting for season five. Of course, yeah. And I've already been, I, at, been being asked questions about it. I'm yeah? Like, I don't know. All right. I, hey, we'll, we'll stay no, away from season five <laughs> questions because we don't need to get into that. Let's, let's yeah, talk right. about your return to Broadway. Yeah, right? sure. So you, you started, how, how young were you when you made your Broadway debut? I was nine years old. I just nine. turned nine. Yeah. Wow. And uh, it was, yeah, I still remember that day. Uh, like it was yesterday, and I remember it, and nothing else. Your career has skyrocketed. Your life has skyrocketed. Now you have an apartment in the city. <laughs> like, how do you yeah. adjust that? Adjust that at 19 years young. I mean, I I, I know you're a young man, sure, but you're still a young man. You're I'm not still pretty. Yeah, pretty small. You have yeah. a lot. Like <laughs> in your universe, you have a lot of people like behind you rooting for yeah. you. Yeah. Well, that's it's incredible. It's a challenge. It's something I'm always uh, considering. It's it's a it's a big responsibility. Mm -hmm. You know, it's a, it's a very rare thing for. Uh, it's a very rare situation for anybody to find themselves in, but I know that uh, Guys. that with Guys. a lot of the, with this platform, there comes a great responsibility and an obligation to, Why is no to one use it for something. Talking? You've been very vocal about what you were born with, yeah. CCD, yeah. Um, and, and you have your organization, I CCD do. Smiles. I oh, of, of course, it's very important because I mean, you're able to help so many people. What does it mean to you when you meet a fan or if somebody comes to a Broadway show or a Stranger Things fan and they come up and they've dealt with something similar? Yeah, it's very shocking. Hmm. in a weird way it's uh it always feels like a new experience every time somebody comes up and relates their situation to uh something similar that i was that i had went through in my in my childhood and mm -hmm. stuff and dealing with it and and growing an identity around something that most would see as a nuisance you've gone through what you yeah. have to help other kids in that situation it's wonderful and yeah. uh if I, i've had people come up to me and especially kids with ccd and talk about how it's like one of the first times they've been able to, they've been able to feel confident. Mm. And them telling me kind of makes me feel like it's the first time I've been, ever been able to feel confident. Wow. Dude, that's awesome. That yeah, makes me wonderful. feel like butterflies inside, no, knowing that you're you able so to help. Much. Yeah, thank uh, no, you. Of, of, I appreciate you bringing it up. Of course, of course. And on Stranger Things, we we heard a little bit of your 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 vocal talent, but I, I <laughs> I'm going way back. All right. So I, I saw a video of you singing Mets. Um, National anthem yeah, at City with my Field, sister. so we know the dude has got some 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 <laughs> pipes. Oh, say can you see? So I was just listening to that video, you were yesterday, and I was so mad because I'm like, that was when I was a tenor. Oh. Like, I remember I was hitting those. I'm like, I just hit a C natural, oh. and I'm like, oh, if I could only get to that again now. You're like, but, I yeah. hit puberty. It was what like, happened? I hit puberty. Yeah. That's funny, dude. So, so for for viewers who only know you from Stranger Things, but will soon see you see you on Broadway, can you give us like a little taste of, of what we can expect from you on stage in terms of the vocals? I've been learning about my own voice and what I've been able to do. It's the first mm -hmm. time I've consistently trained, and I'm learning so much about myself and my own instrument throughout this process. And I'm, it's been a complete honor and pleasure and stuff. And it, yeah, it's been one of the biggest challenges I've ever had because it's wow. a, it's. A, the score is beautiful and the music is gorgeous, but it's very difficult. I have a little secret surprise for you, okay? Do tell! Um, I know that you're in a new film called Honor Society. Yeah, I am! And yes. I know that you play a little smarty pants I do. in the film. Which is very kind of them to consider me to be a smarty pants. I, I was going to say, um, back in the day when you went to Pinelands Regional Junior High School, <laughs> uh, were you, you know, top of your class or what? No. No. No, 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 no. I got the job done. Did. I actually have somebody who can confirm or or deny Wait, that. Don't tell me. On the line right now. Let's see. We have. Wait, is this one of my teachers? Mr. Shore. Oh my God. Say what's up, Gayton. <laughs> old school, buddy. When did they contact you? So uh, I actually uh, ended up talking. Uh, actually, uh, earlier today. Like, no I way. Isn't this Mr. Shore's my junior out. high principal? So, we're asking, was he a good kid was in, in good school? Kid? Was he an honor society honest. kid? Just what you think, he was uh, an outstanding student. Oh, oh, there we go. Oh. Listen, you have not changed. You have, oh. you have been humble. You've always came in with a smile. Uh, always maintained, you know, such a superior attitude. So, Thanks, Mr. Shore. 
always uh, always a pleasure to follow your uh, your successes. Thanks. We'll, uh, hopefully see you around town. I'll buddy. see you soon. All right, you got it. Bye. All right, see you, Mr. Shore. That was you awesome. Love you. <laughs> <laughs> that right. was crazy. So, a little throwback there. So Principal Shore said that Gayton, he would perform on Broadway while he was still in middle school. And then in eighth grade, one stranger things came out. He hit it big. Uh, but you can catch him tonight. Dear Evan Hansen on Broadway. He's back on Broadway at the Music, Bo uh, the music Box Theater, which, by the way, the show closes September 18th. So if you want to go, get oh, your tickets now. You're kidding me. Yes. It's closing. No, it is. Yes. Yeah, Did you ever see it? No. It's such no. a beautiful show. Yeah. And... Um, Intricate and great for the family. Yeah, touching. And yeah. Gayton, he, he's got some pipes, so the yeah. dude can sing. So if you want to see him on Broadway, oh, now he's, got some he's got the real voice. Oh, yeah. yeah. And, and a huge star from Stranger Things. All right. Yeah. Thanks, Ryan. Appreciate it.